Hey everyone, welcome back to Better Biomed. It's a new year, it's 2023, and it's, it's one of those moments where I can go back through and take a look at my statistics and the demographics, and take a look and see the trends that are happening throughout our career field. And there are some trends that are happening. It's pretty interesting. So if you guys didn't know, I, here's the crazy thing about it. Yeah, my YouTube channel is small and everything, but what it does give me is a picture, a, a direct set of data to compare our career field against because Google keeps track of everything. It keeps track of how old the viewer is, what what uh, gender the viewer is. It keeps track of everything, their, their country, their geography. I mean, it, Google keeps track of absolutely everything. I can tell you what hours of what day are most highly capable uh, for Let's say people in Afghanistan, females aged 20 to 30 in Afghanistan. I can get it that specific with Google data because they're that crazy. And that brings me to the next point. At the end of every year, I look at the analytics and I go through and I just want to get a trend and give you guys like a status of what's been going on in our career field. And this year, I've got some crazy stuff to tell you. All right. So... From 2020 to 2021, when I take a look at the analytics, I average 2.1% female viewership. So that means only 2.1% of my viewers in 2020 and 2021 were female. That's kind of almost what you would expect, isn't it? Except if you guys have had your head in the sand, I guess you wouldn't have noticed that our career field is changing drastically. There is a huge influx of female technicians and they're out there kicking ass. And I can prove it. I can prove it compared to anybody else out there in the career field. I can prove it. And the reason I can prove it is because in 2022, I just pulled the stats and I have 8.2%, 8.2% in 2022. How wild is that? I, I went up 6% viewership. Now, this is a, a slice, but you have to remember, a lot of my viewership is younger people, right? And it's not older females that are getting into the career field. It's younger females that are getting into this career field. And I had a delightful conversation with a female senior technician. And she uh, I, I presented some of these stats before I pulled the final end-of-year report. And um, at the time, it was only 8.1%, but, you know, nonetheless, it's almost the same stats. So anyway, I was talking to her and I said, is it really that the demographics are changing so swiftly that now we easily have 10% of our, of our career field is now female? And she said, no, it's much higher, actually. And I, I would agree with that. I would absolutely agree with that. The demographics have shifted completely in the last 10 years. And, but here's the big thing. So I asked her, why is it that my viewership, female viewership has spiked over the last year? And she had the most amazing answer guys and females. <laughs> so she told me that females are much more likely to look up an answer than to go and ask somebody because they've historically had a history, historically had a history, huh? that's funny. Um, of either getting bad information from people or people looking down on them because they think that they should know this already. So instead of like reaching out to any of their male counterparts to find an answer, it's much more likely that a female biomed is going to look up the answer or spend a little bit of time researching before they approach a problem. Guys, we dive right in. We just generally dive right in before we do research, although... I'm a big proponent of doing, you know, uh, YouTube searches and Google searches before I jump into a situation and that saved my bacon a few times, but it's much more likely that females are going to do that. They're more analytical with that. I mean, we're not surprised by that by any means, but talking to her and then talking to other ladies that are in the career field and come to find out it's true. It's true. It's absolutely true. They will, they will get information. You, you, a lot of these ladies out there, they keep pads of paper on them. And you'll see that they're taking notes throughout the day. Well, why are they taking notes? 
they're taking notes because they're going to read up on it either in a minute or later on this evening, this weekend, something. But they're they're doing homework. So, I mean, a lot of you guys out there, I, I'm just letting you know that these ladies are going to, they're stepping in and they're starting to kick some ass. And I have the data to prove it. So, although I would love uh, to help out as many of these ladies as possible, all I'm saying is that, fellas, uh, if they are feeling uncomfortable about approaching you guys for answers, maybe that's a problem with the shop or a problem, you know, I mean, there always has to be a mentorship, right? All technical career fields need a path of progression. It's There's always got to be mentorship of some level in technical career fields or skilled trades. There always has to be a mentorship. And if there's not in your shop, then there's a problem. There's an absolute problem. So uh, anyway, I just wanted to tell you guys all Happy New Year. And as I'm uh, browsing through these demographics and I see something as impressive as that, and then I have a delightful conversation with somebody who can actually back up that data with real facts and real reasons why this is happening. It's, it's actually uh, a very humbling experience to think that uh, some of them are, are using this channel as a reference of whatever sort. And, uh, you know, I'm happy to help and I'm hoping that more of you guys are going to also chip in and help out support your up and coming biomeds. They're out there. They're looking for answers. Can't just be me, man, because I definitely don't have the answers. I'm trying. I'm trying, but I, I definitely don't have the answers, guys. But uh, anyway, just letting you know, they're out there and, and they're definitely kicking some ass. And uh, ladies, I want you to know, I will do whatever I can to help you out whenever. And I do appreciate your support. Thanks for watching, guys.